back to another GM Golf video. Today I kind of had somewhat of a busy day. Woke up, me, Bubby, Steven, and my friend Joe from Kansas City, as you guys have already seen in videos. Went to the gym. After that, I went and filmed the match against Steven. As of now, I haven't gotten a chance to get any practice in or film any YouTube videos so far. And it's already nighttime. It's a little cold outside, but I still wanted to hit some golf shots today. And basically, the lit range is still open. It's going to be open for another two hours. The main thing that I feel like I need to work on right now is my long iron. So I'm basically just going to be going to the lit range and showing you guys a range session of me hitting long irons because that's what I'm really trying to focus and dial in on because you guys saw my wedges video or if you haven't seen my wedges video I've been hitting my wedges really solid recently I've been rolling the putter really well I still struggle to read greens every once in a while but the stroke is feeling good I still need to work on that obviously but I feel like the main thing that I'm struggling with right now is the longer irons so I'm probably gonna hit seven through two iron and literally just hit a bunch of balls today with long irons and see see how I'm hitting it and then show you guys, you know, a lit range video. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. I know it might be it might be boring for some people, but if you guys like watching my progress in my golf game, my golf swing, then then uh, enjoy. Sit back, grab a cup of coffee. Right there, see that edit right there, Bradley? Boom. Maybe some popcorn, whatever you want to do, whatever you guys eat, whatever you guys drink. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. Let's go to Lit Range. It is insanely windy here at the Lit Par 3 course in Lit Range. Like, this whole day when I'm hitting balls, or this whole night while I'm hitting balls, it's going to be blowing super hard, probably. It's looking like, just based off, I mean, that's looking like at least 20, 25 miles an hour. And it's 45 degrees, so it's going to be blowing off the left, which I'm basically going to get a large bucket of balls. I'm going to set up the camera. No music. You guys are going to just be able to listen to every shot how the contact is where the ball is going if i had to guess my goal is going to be to like be hitting a draw somewhat and then it should hopefully just like fade back to the right with this wind but i'm literally going to put my headphones in and i'm just going to grind this range session out i hope you guys like this this type of video i know it's probably boring for a lot of you guys but i'm genuinely just out here to practice and i wanted to i wanted to vlog it for you guys this is going to be a little little tough it's going to be a little brutal i'm not gonna lie all right so here's the situation guys we've made it down to the range i'm basically going to pick one target for the whole night which is going to be this green flag i'm going to set up an alignment stick aka one of my clubs that i'm not using and i'm going from seven iron all the way to two iron and i'm going to be hitting this large bucket of balls sit back enjoy
Okay, I'm gonna talk to the camera for a second, guys. I've hit seven iron, I've hit six iron, now I'm on to five iron. This is typically the part of my game that's been struggling, and I've already hit a few bad shots, like contact-wise, just chunking a few of them. I don't know what it is, it could be a mental thing, but these three clubs that I'm about to hit, the five, the four, and the two iron, I've saved most of the golf balls for because this is the most important part right now that I need to work on. I gotta figure it, I gotta figure it out because I hate not being able to hit my long iron as well. Also, for those of you who are wondering, I moved my like alignment stick to aim me a little bit more left of the green flag. I don't know why, it wasn't fitting my eye very well and the camera, I wanted to get it more along the line, so now I'm aiming a little bit more left of the green flag. I know it's super windy, the audio might be so-so, but midway through me just hitting five iron, I noticed that the camera is pointing way more to the right than I thought. So all of those five iron shots basically looked like I was pulling them straight left. So I just took away the three wood, which was my alignment stick. I took that away to just allow me to free up and just focus on one target, not worry about my alignment. Just like basically to give myself a feel of things. Basically to just have the, the see, feel, trust mentality. So now I'm going for the, the green flag. I got the four in hand. I'm feeling pretty decent right now with the long guys. So I know I, I said I really wasn't gonna talk at all in this range session, but one thing that I was, I started doing midway through my five iron, I started noticing that I was struggling to get through the ball, lower body, whatever, just everything was struggling to get through the ball and I was kind of flinting my hands at it, which I've always been a handsy feel golfer. More than anything, what I started to feel was just like getting my, I don't, I don't know how to explain it, but it's just like forcing my body to get through more. I was hitting way more pure shots. So I don't really know how to explain it. It's more of a mental thing for me because I'm such a feel golfer, but I was really struggling to get through the ball. And now I feel like I'm hitting a lot more solid shots now that I feel like I'm getting more through the ball, if that makes sense.
All right, guys, I'm on to the last club of the range session. I got the two iron in hand. I was actually just striking the four iron really well. I was kind of exaggerating the whole getting shallow thing behind my body, getting up, up in there. So I'm gonna do the same thing with the two iron, kind of exaggerate, getting shallow, and uh, hopefully hit some good shots. Okay, so I know all you guys can hear is audio and you're probably wondering what the frick is going on. Well, I changed the camera angle because currently the camera is sitting angle where when I take this club back, I gotta keep it inside of the camera and when I come through, I have to keep it inside of the camera and if I don't, I'm going to break my camera, which I just bought. So I have to literally keep my club on this path to stay shallow. I'm gonna hit some two irons like this and then I'll be done with the rain session. No, that's it. That's about it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoy. A little range session, a little uh, long irons only. It was actually quite productive. I feel like I had a lot of good shots. I feel like I got through the ball well towards the end. It was end. cold. It was cold. Very cold. But anyways, hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, be sure to stay tuned for the next grinding video where I get worse at golf. Dude, you, you, want, you want us to talk? You want us to? Because I'm just going to say what I always say. We just had some panda. It was fine. How are you doing? That's all I got to offer to the video. You guys have a great night. Much love. Peace.